As we told you going into a break, a tornado hits the Rochester Hills area first thing this morning. It's been a long day out there. Let's check in now live with 7 Action News reporter Jane Park. Jane, what do you have? Well, Jim, we're on Grandview here in the North Fairview uh, Farms neighborhood. Uh, the scene is clearing behind me. Uh, emergency responders. Oops have finished assessing the damage and DTE is here working on a main line that came down. So there are still a few households without power here. And of course, the Salvation Army has been here all day feeding uh, firefighters and families here. They just rolled out a few minutes ago. Volunteers were at Van Hoosen Middle School earlier this morning to evacuated residents. They later came here to Grandview, which is uh, pretty much ground zero of uh, all the damage. It was a three block by three block um, area of damage here. About 30 homes were affected. Seven of those had uh, some significant damage. And of course, Salvation Army has been here providing food, water, a hot dog lunch, also providing blankets because it's been chilly. The rain has been relentless. And of course, they're also providing emotional support for families who had damaged homes. We're not in a uh, city, big city environment. We have a lot of above ground electrical lines. Everything's pretty much underground. It's just some of those main feeds coming in that we had to worry about. This is a pretty traumatic thing, you know, to all of a sudden your house is destroyed in this fashion. And, you know, so we're there. If people want to talk, you know, we're there for them. Again, the good news here is that no one was injured, and emergency responders say they will be leaving here in a couple of hours. Some families will have to stay elsewhere tonight. We are live in Rochester Hills, Jane Park, 7 Action News.